Are we on the brink of becoming cyborgs? Let's talk about Neuralink, the newest venture from Elon Musk, the genius behind electric cars, rockets, and satellites. He's the same fellow with grand plans to colonize Mars and, believe it or not, he's toying with the idea of turning us all into cyborgs. So what's Neuralink? It's a coin-sized chip called the Link that's implanted under your skull. It's got tiny wires or neural threads that spread into parts of your brain controlling motor skills. These threads have 1,024 electrodes each, which can pick up and send electrical signals from your neurons. But implanting them, that's tricky. They're so delicate that a specialized robot looking like a high-tech sewing machine does the job. Uh, what the robot's gonna do is it's going to peel the array uh, the threads one by one from its silicon backing and insert it into the targets that we uh, predetermined in the targeting view. There you go. That's the first insertion. How does it work? It's all about electrophysiology. When you think about doing something like moving your arm, there's a specific pattern of neuron activity and Neuralink aims to capture this preparatory activity. It's not mind reading, but more about predicting what you're about to do. Using machine learning, it translates this brain activity into commands for devices like computers or prosthetics. What's Musk's vision for Neuralink? Short term, helping paralyzed individuals control virtual devices or allowing nonverbal people to communicate. Long term, restoring lost functions like sight or movement, treating neurological conditions, and even enhancing our cognitive abilities. Musk even speculates it could help with mental health, regulating mood, or inducing lucid dreams. Musk spearheads the project, having co-founded Neuralink in 2016 with Max Hodak, a biomedical engineer. They've got a team of experts in neuroscience, robotics, and more. The name Neuralink suggests a connection between neurons and machines, and it's a bit like Neural Ink, hinting at a brain tattoo. Where's Neuralink now? It's in the testing phase. After an initial FDA rejection due to battery concerns, they got the green light for human trials in May 2023. These trials will involve patients with tetraplegia, full limb paralysis, and will span two years. There are challenges, of course, ensuring sterility, preventing degradation, and ensuring the robot's reliability. Safety and ethics, big topics. Concerns range from potential mental health impacts to hacking threats. Neuralink says they've had successful animal tests and emphasize the device's safety and removability. But as with any groundbreaking tech, there's debate and uncertainty. How does it stack up against competitors? There are other players like BrainCo and Kernel, but Neuralink stands out due to its ambitious goals, advanced tech, and Musk's influence. He's known for shaking things up, and with his resources and fan base, Neuralink has a strong position in the market. In a nutshell, Neuralink isn't just tech. It's a vision of the future. Whether you're on board or skeptical, it's a topic that's here to stay. I hope you found this quick dive into Neuralink interesting. Got thoughts? I'm all ears. Thanks for watching. This is AI Girl signing off.